Hello, this is Genghis Don, and we're back. And Race is going to be destroying some trucks because there are things there. They're there they're, they exist. Everyone here at QTV is mourning the loss of one of our own. Maya Morningstar was killed earlier today in a freak aerobic accident when the squat and thrust machine she was exercising on malfunctioned and crushed her like a bug. Maya, we'll miss you. On a happier note, the princess today announced a Candy for Guns Amnesty program in the provinces. The program designed to achieve... So, how did it go? We knew it was a long shot. How did it go? Not so good. Is that... It was. It could have been worse, I suppose. That could have been me. And having had the olive branch of peace thrown back in our face, I say we hunt them down and destroy them like the animals they are. And that's my thought of the day. Brought to you by Utopian Energy. You're so right, Max. It's time to take off the gloves. Thank you, Polly. No, thank you, Max. Say, say you've come up with another plan. I've been working on a new beauty cream. Beauty cream? Did you say beauty cream? Do you think a beauty cream can fix this? You've outlived your usefulness. Bye bye, Mingle. Who passes Bengale, son of Hitler balls? So good, buddy. Looks like they've got themselves a convoy. I agree. Let's take out as many as we can. And the blimp that Ray's apparently disapproves of referencing either the movie or the song. Perhaps both. Not exactly an Ernest Borgman Borgnine fan. Those trucks are headed somewhere in a hurry. Let's make sure they don't get there. Yeah, we're just gonna pass these fuels by. For the most part. That's a problem. That took care of itself. As is patently obvious, the foliage is somewhat rotted. And a another biting look at how war has tainted the fuels. In desperation, they seem to be turning to any supplies they can muster from their once from their uh, war machine. They're now having supply problems, having their uh, factory at the machine. Oh no, I'm about to die. Let me stop waxing philosophic and uh, murder things. And some players just suck. Maybe I'm just stupid. Place. 
seem to be on their last legs, but they're getting desperate. And that's lending it, and that's manifesting in uh, some doggedness in their defense. We'll see a lot more of that as the game goes on. Desperation, experience, desire for vengeance. All built upon a single minded dog xenophobic worldview. That's not exactly a uh, recipe for anything good. As a poet might say. If he suffered from brain damage. We're drained health and surface well in the past, and I'm too set in my ways to change. I'm a hypocrite. That's always fun to watch. I believe what he said was, I believe, so this is what head trauma feels like. I've inflicted so much. He might have been cut off though. Another one of my favorite quotes from this game. It's what kept me and my friends playing. At least for a night. That's exactly what I was looking for at that particular moment. Ah, oh, there's a problem. encounters with heights before, so I'm going to leave that alone. One problem.
I'll just face it, I'm not a marksman. Rob averages. At some point, enough decent to connect. and wreck. At least we'll die with the saddles on our back. That has nothing to do with this game. Rage just likes killing things. It's much more akin to uh, Telltale Heart without the uh, guilt. The dialogue. Truck, well, I'm not sure where it was going anyway, the bridge is gone. Yeah, that's a good point. That's, seems like a dead end. I guess that blimp was. Yeah. Well, yep. There, there's a little fellow who is definitely satisfied with his career choice. As we saw in the uh, news, cemetery stocks are up and veteran care. Um, how do I put this? Our people, they really take into the war. Uh, they find it, they find it fun. They, they like to dress up. They like the high tech of it all. It's just that they're not very good at it. We might have to accept the fact that we aren't going to win. Well, thank God, at least they can't get inside the Great Wall. Uh, mm. They can't get inside the Great Wall, mm. can they? Stay right there. I'll kill you later. It's time for some damage control. Max, it's me. How'd you like a new job? And that's why I'll be leaving QTV to become the new Culet Information Minister. Oh, Max. So I went to pink. So mass grave stocks are up and slow at pink are up. They're... Yeah, they're on their back legs now. They're driven by hate, determination, and cannibalism. And chronic self-delusion. That's... Don't tell me they're not expecting us! Dr. Mingle is working on a way to make candy out of monster meat. Do you know how much candy that would be? Raze has a very self-satisfied nod there. Oh yeah, you know what's coming. Raze is a, a dumb brute. He's he's a sociopath at this point. He shows intelligence. He understands exactly what he's doing. The war destroyed him a lot earlier on than it did the Kiwots. Not exactly. Last meal, I would like Doc uh, Laurence. Captain, the monsters are fighting back and they're killing Hulix. Oh, so you want to play rough? Let's get it, boys. <laughs> 
probably should rethink their blinders policy. I guess their ears probably aren't that good at their peripheral vision either. What the? Well, I only really knew Baxter for about a week. Well, looks like we're in the land of shrooms now. Not sure what these creatures are. They're fairly indifferent to us. Okay, so I got turned around. All right. Parts of the environment are destruct destructible. He was very pleased with his evisceration. Fill out your comment card so I can do this better next time. Oh hell. No. Just can't get away. Oh, it will. It has to. Well, we'll get through it. That's what the easy setting's for. When you don't feel like hitting a roadblock and just getting stuck on it for so long. Entrenched defenses, huh? They Let's are see learning. What's behind door number one, shall we? Something. What's There's gonna be a problem. Well, it would have been. If it ever gets back up. No, it's up. I just can't see it now. And my maneuvers are limited. Cursed cue of confidence. Yeah, I guess if they survive the events of the game this long, they have to be at least capable of. not dying. Well, advance seems to be the order of the day. Oh hell. I really can't see these guys. Well, I was. Yeah? If those things were ever cute and cuddly, that. Whatever affection they had for life is uh, pretty much burned out of them now. Whatever their ambitions now, he's satisfied with his life work of genocide.
super cute. And he's doing me a favor of uh, in that he's jibotizing everything for me. Bypass me. Why not? And we're back to some good old Robin Gun Sun. They're gonna need a lot of that now. Why die? Cutify. Say it loud, say it proud. I'm cute and I'm proud. He is almost sad at how cute he is. He just can't contain his pride. That must have been satisfying for us. And if you hated my narration? More so. These are set pieces, apparently. seems to be inside. Well, we don't really have one. Just kill things. I'm going to try to remain silent. If somebody cool in the air, there's bound to be some interesting dialogue. Let's go around collecting squibs like this. But maybe eating their own. Maybe maybe eating the pastified remains of their kin, or I guess that would leave a bitter taste in one's mouth after after time. Not to mention a host of degenerative brain disease. Checkpoints. Who's fine? Sorry about that, Zorlock. That's always fun. Especially when we have good. Well, stranger things have happened. 
Yeah, he does it better than I do. Did you know that some monsters resist us? I swear, they're out there getting organized, planning something. It's crazy. Well, whatever, man. Pass the bonbon. We're gonna find you. This sugar high is making me crazy, I guess. La 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 He couldn't have gone far. It might seem strange that they are unaware of the monster resistance, but considering their news media, yeah. I'm coming, Mom. I'm coming, Dad. Want to get into your loving arms? Rusty, is that you, boy? Oh, he got to see his dog again. A minefield. Rays, wait! They've mined this area! Be cautious and let me guide you through safely. Feel the mines. Be oh yes, they have that telepathic link I forgot about. My kill count is distressingly low today. Cheap shot. Should make navigating this thing easy. easier. So I'd like to keep you guys alive for the dialogue. Yeah, I'd rather just not die as much. On an interesting note about minefields, the uh, demilitarized zone between North and South Korea along the 38th parallel. Despite being, um, well, a minefield, it's actually something of a wildlife reclamation success story. Uh, bird watchers will often comment that uh, many rare species that haven't been seen in that region for decades, maybe even centuries, have taken roost there Come back out now. and occasionally explode. I'm not sure if uh, seeing a rare bird land on a mine and explode is like bonus points for a bird watcher or something, but it should be. And that's a sniper, right? He's cunningly concealed in foliage that doesn't exist in these parts. It's like wearing a cactus helmet in Antarctica. I call her Mary Jane. You always see cactus helmets, like, no. That's not an enemy soldier, he's just just a cactus. Okay, okay. Taking cover behind this side. It's a obvious con obviously well constructed. I mean look at it. Not a scratch on it. Should really open my eyes though. I'm just guessing. 
Yeah, sarcasm. Lowest form of comedy. Not that it really matters, it's still hilarious. Properly executed. You'll have to look for other videos for that, I imagine. Well, looks like we're out of the minefield. Oh, look, it's our friend. Maybe not. A rather successful run, I think. Scrap Beep seem to suggest that they're uh, engaging in a recycling campaign, somewhat analogous to uh, some similar campaigns in the United States during the uh, 40s. Housewives, save your thoughts for explosives. You do not recycle, you ride with Hitler, or something like that. You won't make it straight through the gates directly. Let's head out. He has very little confidence in our abilities. Can't say I blame him. You've seen me get stranded on some cards before. Waste of a shot. Who cares? And good. That's a victory screen. Yeah, it's good place to to hold off for now. Next episode, I imagine we're going to be seeing the. Uh, we're probably going to be seeing Qtopia soon. We've always seen that in the news. And you know how the news distorts things. I mean, uh, you know that cemetery industry is just a big bubble. It's going to burst any day. Which is why you need to put all your stocks in candy. I'll see you next time. This is Genghis Don of Donorom signing out, thankfully.